St. John's School offers a diverse and challenging learning environment for its elementary and middle school students. The students are bright, energetic, and digitally capable of using technology. The middle school students are aware of the various uses of equipment and would increase their learning levels if they could use more 2.0 tools in the classroom. Teachers should learn to be well versed in technology instruction because a whole new landscape of learning is at our fingertips. Four specific 2.0 tools that the school could utilize more are Google Docs and Spreadsheets, PowerPoint presentations, Windows Movie Maker, and blogging. Google Doc is a great way to share the students' documents without exchanging paper. There's only one file located in the cloud which both teacher and student have access to, and revisions and comments are made together as a team. No more losing papers anymore. Another great 2.0 tool are the Google Spreadsheets, which are an excellent way for students to create charts and graphs. Again, because it's a Google Spreadsheet, it can be accessed from the cloud. This is a good tool for students to independently keep track of their own grade, or, in this case, keep track of the latest sports elimination rounds. PowerPoint presentations are something that I've recently learned to do and I've become a strong PowerPoint advocate. Students at St. John's are already using this tool for displaying charts and presentations or anything to show on the big screen. Gone are the days of poster board presentations. Using this technology, students have the ability to make creative displays of their knowledge. Windows Movie Maker is a tool that many students will love and it's easy to get familiar with. Students can build their PowerPoint presentation skills into making videos of their own work. Movie Maker is a great way for pulling together a student's research and honing in on creative ways to present it. Higher thinking skills are sharpened to develop a storyboard, understanding the target audience, and making the information interesting. And lastly, blogging has become a new form of communicating between teachers and students. Getting them to share their ideas online is becoming more and more popular since this tool includes all classmates on any given topic. No more wallflowers who don't participate. Everyone has a voice with blogging. There's a multitude of resources for teachers to learn 2.0 tools to teach to their students. By using these new innovative tools, St. John's can prepare its students better to enter high school and careers using 21st century skills. At the rate technology is increasing in the schools, it won't be long before students will have access to their classes online anytime, anywhere. St. John's should stay ahead of the waves of technology by encouraging these digital natives to use the tools they feel most comfortable with. What are your feelings for online instructions for high school from from a uh, St. John's as a St. John's student feeding into that? I think it's a great idea. We uh, we don't have very many. Our technology is not technically uh, up to date. So it would so for example, we don't have a Prometheus board or smart board in the classroom. So there's some resources that the kids are not not getting to take advantage of right now. So the idea of online instruction. Encouraging online instruction would be great for St. John's.